Hey everybody, I just wanted to point something out real quick. Uh, on my 3PAR array here that I'm uh, currently installing, I've added some additional SSD drives. So if we look just real quick down here at the SSD section, now this is virtually a new array, so there, there isn't really anything on it, and I, I do plan to make a couple of additional videos. But what I wanted to point out was I, I had to admit the hardware, okay? Uh, and essentially all that is is I, you know, I log into the commands, uh, command line here, and I'll type... Um, Pardon me, let me scroll to my entry. But you're going to do it at an admit uh, HW for hardware, right? So here, admit HW when you add additional capacity. And in this case, I added 32 SSD drives. So once that goes through, it upgrades all the, uh, all, all the PDs and initializes, uh, begins to initialize the drives. All right, so that takes me over to this screen where when I select the array, I can go to capacity and look at the drives that I have in the system. And again, we're just going to focus here on the SSD side. You can see here that I have initialized free space and uninitialized free space. The initialized free space are the chunklets that are already prepared and ready for allocation into those logical disks. Uninitialized is the new capacity that I just added to the array. And it is still initializing, creating the chunklets, and making those available. Once it has completed, then this uninitialized will zero out. If we look at my fast class here, a little bit still going there. I want near line. Here we go. So my uninitialized near line is zero because all of the near line drives have completed their initialization process. So again, here is. Um, at 36.58%, let me click refresh. I know this takes a little while. <clears throat> Still waiting for the green arrow down here to finish, right there in the corner. Still waiting. And you can actually see here under the recent tasks, uh, I'm doing a conversion right now. Um, so there's a little bit of additional work going on, but not a big deal. So looks like it's still, you know, still in process. Uh, it's going to take probably a little while to actually become initialized, but I have plenty of free space. I can go ahead and start uh, provisioning my, my array. So I just wanted to point out that the, the difference between initialized and uninitialized. Also, if you look at allocated, right? So I do have some capacity already allocated in SSDs. But we can look at, uh, let's look at CPG space, right? So how much space is being used versus unused that's already allocated to the CPG. Uh, any snap space that's being used or unused. The admin space is that it's required. And of course, we can look down here and I can see my spare spare space, right? I'm not sparing anything out, so it's all unused right now, and that's how much spare capacity I have. Okay. So I just wanted to point out real quick, um, you know, when you add capacity, this is how you tell whether or not it's ready to start being used, all right? You, you just wait for the uninitialized to complete, and it moves that capacity into your initialized area, and now it's free to go ahead and start provisioning your array. Okay, thanks.